6, the nonprofit organization Sight Savers of America gave away free take home high tech vision aids to 15 children with severe visual impairment at the PD Education Service Center in Florence. News 13's Gabby Jonas attended the event today to learn more about how this equipment is changing families' lives. I couldn't read that, I could read it now. The United States of America. 15 severe visually impaired children received high-tech vision take-home aids, allowing them to magnify up to 118 times the object's size, contrasting colors and shapes, helping with educational and everyday activities. Chief Program Officer for Sight Savers of America, Jennifer Haddock, says a child who has severe permanent visual impairment often sees at 2200, meaning they have to be 20 feet away from something someone without visual impairment could see at roughly 200 feet away. Making high visual aid helps something like reading dollar bills go from this to this. You know, pointing the camera back on their face or their mom's face or being able to read, um, you know, letters on their own comfortably um, without the paper at their nose. You know, they're sit back like, it, like we do at a computer screen and it's just, it's thrilling to see their excitement. Sixth grader at Hartsville Middle School, Jack Threat says the new portable aid makes him fortunate to have help from the visual aid teachers from Sight Savers of America saying his visual journey has been nothing short but uniquely his. Honestly exciting. I get more things to play around with to help me explore or to help do work or read something or do something. Let's say one child with severe visual impairment wanted to focus on one singular sentence while reading. They'll use this visual aid remote to use line markers, making sentences like our eyes see blue a whole lot easier to read. Haddock says being able to see the children's excitement while pointing the visual aid camera on their own faces or doing activities they enjoy with more clarity is something she never gets tired of seeing. Yeah, you know, we hear things like, I can read now, and Mom, I can see your face, and it's, it's really great to be part of that. Threet says he's excited to now be able to read one of his favorite books called Dogman without having to have it read to him. Reporting in Florence, Gabby Jonas, News 13.